Okay, so I, I like my trees almost like touching the ceiling, right? So I want, I feel like it's still, this is just me being me, but let, let's see. Good evening. I am going to take you along with me. Nowhere. We're going to be at home, however. I am planning to do some things around the house tonight. Um, start with putting up Christmas decorations in segments. Today we're going to try to get the tree in the living room up. But with that, I do need to, I'm going to move the room around a little bit. And then that is going to prompt need to move some other things. Um, I have some floating shelves in the living room that I want to take down. My husband is not here. He is hunting and so he will find that out when he gets back. I like to do this like surprise. I'll see if he notices. Um, we'll see how that goes. I gotta wash this so I'm going to run into the shower and um, wash my hair. So I may look a little crazy this evening, but that's okay. Where this is a safe space for us all to look crazy as we kind of, you know, move around the house and get things together. So I'll check back in after my shower. Okay, see you soon. are eating now I want to get to the evening stuff so let's break it down I got to be realistic it's what like 7 40 what time is it Seven fifty. so what I want to do tonight I want to put our Christmas tree up in our living room. Our living room is a little bit smaller. So, and I want the Christmas tree to be center um, in the windows, it's like center. So, <clears throat> that will require me to move some furniture around, reconfigure a little bit, which is fine. I do that. I've done that every year for our, you know, for our Christmas tree. Um, and I also want to remove these floating shelves. Okay, so, I think I'm over the floating shelves. I'm not connecting with it anymore. I don't know, it could be, like they're really cute, and I they were um, a really dark wood color when I first bought them, and then I spray painted them this cream color. I think I'm over it, and this pedestal thing, fun fact, I have three of them in this house. I'm gonna move this podium to I think a different part of the house that, that could be really good for it. And then I have this plant, this concrete planter that I got from Amazon that I'm gonna move into that corner. This side of the room is way too, the word I'm thinking of is heavy. Right, and that's why I put the couch on that side to balance it out. But I think this will then also help balance the room out over there. So then the wall of shelves are displayed. And I also have to do this tonight. So it's 7.53. Realistically, can I get this done? 
by 10.30. All of it, hair, everything. So that's what I want to do right now. Because I feel like the height is too short. I want a taller. I like my trees almost like touching the ceiling. Right? So. Okay. So I prop my phone up. So that I can compare heights. Because right now it feels a little short. But I think it's because it's been on this side. And the shelves go all the way to the ceiling. At least the trim does. So I think it just felt taller. It feels like it could be propped up a bit. So I'm recording a video just so I can compare the heights. Let me confirm on the video first. So I propped up the tree a little bit higher with the floating shelves that we just took down. So we're already recycling and repurposing um, so should I go up one more? just so that's done and that's prepped for the morning because I got to leave a little bit early around 9.30, 9.40. So I'm not a morning person so I don't really give myself as much time as I probably should in the morning to get ready. So I need to do as much as I can before I go to bed. So I'm, gonna, I'm thinking knocking this out will just help. So if I don't get the tree up today, that's okay. What I am going to do, after I straighten my hair, do that, I am going to rearrange the living room, basically prepping the space so I could do the tree tomorrow evening.
for the evening. Um, I had a productive evening. I am not mad about what was accomplished. Um, rearranged the room, even though I basically just put it back and moved the chairs. But conceptually, I had to figure out the best way for this tree to be positioned in this room. And it is um, a rather, it's a big, a wider tree. Um, so the diameter of the tree is 48 inches. So we have to make sure both ways we can cover that. Um, and so I think this is the best way to do so. So thank you for spending time with me. And I hope I didn't bore you, but I look forward to I'm just highlighting little moments that, that occur in my evening. So again, let me know if you like them in the comments below, but I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye.